China set to launch its 14th manned mission to the Tiangong Space Station, which will carry three astronauts to the Tiangong Space Station. This mission is a turning point, shifting from maintaining station systems to conducting advanced scientific research. The spacecraft and its Long March 2F rocket are now at the Jiuquan Satellite Launch Center, undergoing final checks. As the 14th manned spaceflight in China's ambitious program, Shenzhou-19 aims to push the boundaries of space research. In this video, we'll explore the mission's objectives, how China has prepared for this launch, and the evolving role of Tiangong. Stay with us as we uncover why this mission could reshape the future of space exploration. The Shenzhou-19 mission is set to be a game-changer in China's space endeavors, focusing on more complex tasks than any previous crewed mission to the Tiangong space station. Unlike earlier missions, where astronauts concentrated on system testing and adjusting to life aboard, Shenzhou-19 shifts toward conducting advanced scientific research. This is a crucial milestone for China's space program, reflecting a new era of space capabilities. A key aspect of this mission is the array of scientific and technological experiments the crew will undertake. According to Aerospace Magazine's chief editor, Wang Yanan, these studies go beyond the basics of maintaining station systems. Instead, they include research that can only be done in a microgravity environment experiments in materials science, fluid dynamics, and space medicine that could lead to new technological innovations. Such research has the potential to transform industries on Earth from manufacturing to pharmaceuticals. The new crew is also tasked with ensuring a smooth transition with the outgoing team from Shenzhou 18, led by senior Colonel Yi Guangfu. This process is crucial for keeping Tiangong operational and maintaining the momentum of continuous research. This crew rotation allows ongoing experiments to proceed without interruption, maximizing the station's productivity. This mission also stands out because it reflects China's growing confidence in its ability to maintain a human presence in space over the long term. The Shenzhou-19 crew will push the station's capabilities, tackling more sophisticated research and leveraging the experience gained from previous missions. By doing so, they are not only contributing to China's scientific goals, but also positioning the country as a leader in space exploration. The preparation for the Shenzhou-19 mission has been a meticulous process, reflecting the high standards set by the China Manned Space Agency CMSA. The combination of the Shenzhou-19 spacecraft and its Long March 2F rocket was recently moved to the launch pad at the Jiquan Satellite Launch Center, a critical step that marks the final phase before liftoff. This phase involves a comprehensive series of tests, including pre-launch system checks, fuel assessments, and joint tests between the rocket and spacecraft. These procedures ensure that every component functions flawlessly before the launch. The CMSA has confirmed that all systems are in excellent condition, which is crucial for a mission of this scale. This attention to detail is particularly important given the high risks associated with manned space travel, where even a minor oversight could lead to significant consequences. Located in the Gobi Desert, the Jiquan Satellite Launch Center is a strategic choice for China's space missions. Its remote location offers vast open space, minimizing risks to populated areas during rocket launches. The center has become a symbol of China's ambitions, housing many of the country's most significant space missions, including earlier Shenzhou missions and other satellite launches. It is a testament to China's ability to develop and maintain world-class space infrastructure. The Long March 2F rocket, known for its reliability, will be responsible for carrying the Shenzhou-19 spacecraft into orbit. This rocket has a solid track record, but spaceflight is inherently unpredictable. To mitigate these risks, the CMSA's rigorous pre-launch processes aim to ensure that everything is in top shape before the launch window opens. This phase of preparation is not just about ensuring technical readiness, it's about demonstrating China's commitment to the highest standards in space exploration. The thorough checks and readiness tests illustrate China's determination to make this mission a success, reinforcing the nation's growing reputation as a space power, ready to take on increasingly challenging space endeavors. T-1 
Tiangong has become more than just a space station. It's the heart of China's long-term space strategy. Since its completion in 2022, the Tiangong Space Station has provided China with a versatile platform for human spaceflight and cutting-edge research. Now, with the upcoming Shenzhou-19 mission, Tiangong is entering a new phase, focusing on advanced scientific experiments and sustained operations in low Earth orbit. Situated about 400 kilometers above Earth, Tiangong comprises a core module and two scientific capsules, providing ample space for research. It is uniquely positioned to conduct experiments that can only be performed in microgravity. For instance, studying how fluids and materials behave in this environment can lead to breakthroughs that are impossible to achieve on Earth. This makes Tiangong an invaluable asset for scientific progress with potential applications in medicine, materials science, and even future space travel technologies. Research conducted here could even inform future missions to Mars or beyond, helping to prepare for long-duration spaceflight. The Shenzhou-19 mission will push Tiangong's capabilities further, using the station's advanced laboratory facilities for new experiments. The transition from basic station operations to more complex research signifies a shift in focus. Now that astronauts have become accustomed to life aboard, they can devote more time and resources to scientific endeavors. This evolution is not just about expanding China's scientific knowledge, it's about establishing the country as a major player in the international space community, capable of leading in various fields of space research. Tiangong's role also extends beyond China's borders. While it primarily serves China's research needs, it offers a potential platform for international collaboration. The station could host astronauts or experiments from other countries in the future, further integrating China into the global space exploration landscape. Such collaborations could enhance global scientific efforts, enabling researchers worldwide to access the unique environment Tiangong offers, fostering knowledge exchange and joint missions. The Shenzhou-19 mission is, therefore, a critical step in utilizing Tiangong's full potential. It represents China's commitment to making the most of this space laboratory, pushing boundaries and setting the stage for even more ambitious space missions in the years to come. This mission not only highlights China's advancements in space, but also demonstrates its willingness to contribute to the global understanding of space science, positioning Tiangong as a key hub in the next era of space exploration. As China continues to expand its presence in space, Tiangong could become a cornerstone of future interplanetary exploration and scientific breakthroughs. In this video, we have learned about China's Shenzhou-19 mission to the Tiangong Space Station, exploring its objectives, the meticulous preparations for launch, and the expanding role of Tiangong in China's space ambitions. We hope you learned something new. If you did, please give us a like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Don't forget to leave a comment below and tell us what you think about this news and what you would like to know more about. We would love to hear from you. Thank you for watching and see you next time.